All right. Said I was gonna get it. Finally, uh, went, found it, and uh, got it again. <clears throat> this is the CO2 version of that uh, last air cannon I built. I made this. Oh God. Um. I had to take a guess. Probably about a good twelve years ago. Considering, um, yeah, my uh, my tank expired back in 2012. So yeah, it's been a good long while since I uh, made this CO2 cannon. Again, same thing as the other one. It uh, shoots out the Nerf Vortec footballs. Or pretty much anything else that fits down a two-inch barrel with the uh, fins trimmed down. But all it is is two-inch piece of PVC, two-inch PVC cap, a male to female 90 degree fitting, a short uh, just one-inch coupler, a ball valve. This is a Four to four inch section of cast iron pipe, a another adapter, and then this is just a straight up paintball gun uh, remote adapter plug. They screw right in. There's nothing special with that. Just a little spacer to help hold this pipe off of that. And uh, CO2 tank. It's the remote adapter. Plugs right into the front, fire, off. So you just kind of open it real quick and close it, and it shoots out the end. Um, all of these pipes are half inch, and it's all just standard cast iron gas pipe. And yeah, out of a regular CO2 tank, I think we were getting about, oh, I want to say somewhere between 30 to 40 shots before needing to fill this and this at five bucks versus the 12 grams that you can get 40 of them I think for like 10 to 15 dollars over at Walmart. We used to actually have this set up with the 12 gram CO2 adapter right on the end, screws right into it, nothing special as long as this is a half inch pipe. And then it was a single shot, replace the cartridge, put a new one back in, shoot it again. And again, this still shot about between 100, 125 yards. But anyways, it's the CO2 version of the last air cannon we made. And hope you enjoy it. Have fun. Thanks for stopping in.